Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we will learning about API with delete method. So why do we use delete method? Set up Postman for delete API. How to make route delete function and test API with Postman. The first one I will answer why do we use delete method? We use delete method for deleting the data from the database. You can also use the post method. You can use the put method to delete the data. But the standard one, we recommend it to use the delete method. Okay. So in this uh, tutorial, you need at least one controller and one model for uh, testing the delete APIs. So in here is my project. It is continue from uh, learning about post method and uh, uh, put method. As you can see here, I have already created one model uh, device and one controller device controller and has some uh, function here. It is it is function for uh, insert the data to the database and we it is exist in the post method learning video and here is the put uh, method that exists in the put uh, method video that I have uh, show you in uh, the previous so you can look back to see uh, what is uh, post method what is put method and how to do it how to uh, test it with postman okay so this is kind of new from that i will create this one for testing the delete data like function delete i just return some string return return every string here I put the key result and my result is um, delete success so now I create one API route for this function let me save it first we go to route and api.php yes I copy this and then the UL the method here we use delete and my UL is delete and the function in the controller device is delete so please check the unit to import the device controller in API route also okay let me save it and we go to postman here I add new in the same way you can see here is the um, let me copy this it is the previous video that talk about put method so this is having a new uh, ul we choose delete and we pass in here and the ul is delete okay let me write something here and we want to test it will it correct or not okay i just type id one and then it so the lead success so now i I don't want to send that time through this but I just put only ID in here through the URL and it will go to update the database table device here okay we will update this sorry we will delete this and which one you want to delete you can specify in uh, the ID in the postman in here okay so this is we need to change a little bit in our api route so in route we need, we need to put the parameter id 
So ID here. And then we go to function delete in our controller. Let me save it first. And we get the ID. Okay. We get the ID from this. And then we declare one parameter device. So device fan. This is the model name you can see here. I have imported it. So you can find like in here I want to delete the last row here. The ID is seven. So I specify here it just an ID. We will specify it through the uh, postman in here. So like this and we declare one result parameter result equal device and we use function delete. Okay, like this. So if result true is a result true, we return delete success in here and L fail or operation fail. Operation fail. Like this. Let me save it. I go to Postman and I specify the ID like this and I send it. You can see here the result is delete success. So let me check the table in here. Let me rephrase it. And you can see here if the, the uh, last record have deleted. For example, I want to delete this one. You can specify the URL like number three. I change this to number three. Send it. You have delete success. You can check in the database in here. Okay. So this is how to use delete method to uh, delete data in the database by using the API and we test it with the Postman. So that's all for my presentation about the lead method with the API. So thank you for watching.